welcome to a new vlog guys today we are in the republic of san marino let's go vlogging Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you a very special place, a small one as well. They speak Italian in here and they are surrounded by Italy by 360 degrees. But we are not there guys, we are not in Italy because we are in the third smallest country in Europe after the Vatican and Monaco. This is the Republic of San Marino which is one of the oldest republic in the world. Let's go vlogging! Okay guys, waiting for the first ride, the first train to go to Rimini. Okay guys, first stop Rimini. Now guys, we are going to buy the ticket to get on the bus to the final destination. Let's go. Easy peasy. Now, guys, the very good thing about entering San Marino, as I am Italian, is that I do not need the green pass. And even in their museums, bars, restaurants, cinema, whatever, I don't need it, which means I will feel like free once again in a way. So let's go and get the bus and start the adventure. Here we go, guys, at the bus stop. Okay guys, we have finally arrived, we are in the Republic of San Marino and today guys we are in the capital which actually has the same name San Marino and we are not going to check the suburbs and the little villages but look at what I have already mm, Look at that people! San Marino guys is 750 meters above sea level so now guys, after the very first beautiful view, we are going to start the tour in the country. It's actually a bit weird because I feel like I'm in Italy, but we are not. And we're going to go and check some towers first. Let's go. Okay guys, some signs already, you know I love them very first overview of the place guys let's have a look at the colors and the buildings okay guys we are starting the tour there and then we're just going to go up there and see what we find starting off guys we have the search of san francesco right in front of us guys we will be walking a lot and we will be going up quite a lot today as well some more stair guys to go up well guys not only it is a beautiful day but the scenery around us is very nice So guys, this is where we are at, that's the name of the street, which is a very happy woman. And in fact, there are sculptures of women along the way. Let's see? And another one here. So guys, I am lost already, so I'm going to follow the signs and we're going that way. Okay guys, we're just following the street. The plan guys has already gone out the window in a way. 
but we are going to see the towers i just found myself in the town center and i got lost immediately that happens don't you worry though because oh i'm looking at very nice things so guys as we are here we're going to actually see that building there first what i noticed guys that there are many statues of women in general and there are also many tourists around okay so this is like a little park should i say with the statues and i just want to have a look at that one there okay all right so this is where we are at guys that is the stairs giuseppe rossi basically this one here and i guess that that was a place where they used the arch or something and again guys more statues let's have a look from the top Um, here we are guys, we will have a lot of views today Worth it Okay guys, so from down there we came up all the way there And we're now going to go up there The Adriatic Sea guys in front of us. How cool! This kind of like tags, black signals with the braid language. By the way guys, this is what we're going to see next. Beautiful people, beautiful. All the shops to the side guys, as you can see here. Very lively for a Sunday morning, I have to say. And here we are, people. So we can see Palazzo Pubblico, which is basically the town hall of the capital city and it was built in the 18th century and the material was taken from Mount Titano, which we will see later. Very nice, right guys? And also with these lovely bars and restaurants behind it. Now it's time to go to the three towers. Let's go. First tower to the right, guys. Right, guys, we are getting closer. Let's continue that way. Okay, guys, this vlog is basically about views. There is a panoramic view there, which we are going to see right now. Won't be talking too much in this video, guys. Look at that. No. Let's go. This is guys when I actually need someone to take pictures for me because look at that. It's beautiful but I am by myself enjoying this but most of all I'm by myself to take pictures. Nah. Okay guys, enough with the view. Let's go to the very first tower. Time to buy a souvenir, guys. Okay, guys, I actually need to buy something for my grandparents as they ask me. All the magnets look really nice. I don't really know which one to get. Right, guys, I bought this for my grandparents. What do you think? Walking here, guys, is actually very, very lovely. Like, the scenery is very beautiful. So that one, there guys, that's the first tower. Okay guys, waiting in line to get the ticket. As we are inside, we have the ticket for the two towers. The third one is actually closed, we cannot go there. 
and let's have a look at what we have around all right guys so this is where we are walking and a bit of the tower over there we're following the path and look as well at the view again i think you might be bored about that now <laughs> People. And here we go, people. Tower and view. Right, people. Let's continue there. Okay, guys, the first tower we've seen is from the 13th century, and the three towers in total are actually featured on the San Marino flag. Okay guys, now we have a very lovely view, that is the second tower. Anyway guys, it is now time to go on to the second tower. Now guys, we are going to follow that path, as you can see, to get there, which is called Il Passo delle Streghe, which translates to the witch's path. So, I'm just gonna put my witch hat on guys, and I'm just gonna walk down. Guys, I don't know about you, but this far, this country is amazing. Scenery is beautiful, like the castle, the towers, the views. Let me know down in the comments what you think already. And here we are, people, at the entrance. There inside, guys, there is also the army museum. So we're going to see a lot of guns and all that kind of thing. Okay, guys, second tower. Let's get in. And the tower guys from the outside and again overlooking this beautiful view. Okay guys, we are towards the end, we're going to go down and then leave. We are now going to leave the second tower, we are going to head towards the third one, but I don't really think we can get on top, I think it's close to the public, but we'll continue the tour anyway. Here we go, to the right. we go people get in there and here we are guys on the third tower a better view with the sun here we cannot get in it or on it we can just go around it but still it was a lovely walk all right guys since we are at the end we have seen the three towers we are now going to go back into town and have something to eat because i've been walking for two three hours now and my phone is dying so i need to charge it as well so we'll see you there okay guys we are back in the main square where we were before piazza della libertà and we are now actually going to see some museums now here in san marino guys there are many museums i've actually uh, realized and ticket of the towers also includes uh, four different museums. I just had to pay two euros more, which I think was very great. So we're going to see some of them. So let's get ready for some art or I don't know what we will find, but let's go and have a look. Okay guys, we are in Piazza Titano, this lovely square. And there, that's the entrance of the National Museum. In this museum we can find a little bit about the history of the country and also some art artifacts from Roman times, Neolithic and other areas as well. So 
some Roman artifacts, as you can see here. Here guys, we have some objects from the Middle Age and those there are Roman coins. Okay guys, something more interesting, although you may already know I don't really like religious paintings, but the Roman columns there, yes, I like it, look at that, and that one there. Going upstairs, people, let's continue the tour. Okay, that's a doll representing Jesus Christ. I'll be creeping there from outside. <laughs> but here we have already some more religious art, as you can see, guys, and paintings. Some colorful ceramics as well. We continue with the paintings, guys, and I see more here. Look at that, guys. This is San Marino in miniature, if you can say that. We were kind of there when we arrived and we went all the way up there to see the towers on the top. Okay guys, I wanted to share this one. This is Il Martirio di Santa Agata. So that's Saint Agatha. But they are like taking the boob out. What the hell? And this very massive piece as well in front of us. Okay guys, this really did draw my attention because of the dark around it. Look at that. We are already at the end of the tour of this very lovely small museum. It's time to move on now. Let's go. Moving on guys, we are in front of the church of San Francesco. We can actually go inside the church because we have the tickets, so we should go and see some cool art, hopefully. Let's have a look. Guys, we are just going to go just inside the museum of San Francesco because to get into the church you have to be fully covered. I have a mini skirt, so we cannot let go inside. Okay guys, we are in, it's very very silent, but we are going to see a lot of paintings, look already. Okay, this is cool. You know guys, I always say in my vlogs that I'm not into religious art, which is true, but I always end up in these places at the end of the day. <laughs> anyway, I mean, at least the colors are beautiful. It's not that I don't appreciate them, it's just not my kind of art, but why not have your look anyway? Okay, we have some paintings and statues of women here actually. And again, okay, guys, and this one is done as well. On to the next one. Mm, that's our bus, guys, to go back to Rimini. Let's go back home. Okay guys, it's now time to end this vlog. I hope you did enjoy coming along with me. I hope you liked San Marino. If you ever come here, it's really recommended. Small country, but very beautiful with a lot of things to see and look at the weather today. We were really lucky. Anyway guys, thank you for watching. As always, I will see you in the next vlog. Take off girl is out. Bye.